this vlog will be sponsored by love me hair so we're gonna hop straight into it starting with the packaging as always you guys know i love love me hair i love their packaging for obvious reasons i'm a purple lover so let's hop straight into it this is the box right here you have a note right here that i really really love there's a reward brochure here's a bag in case you don't want to keep the box there's a user guide with caps labels there's a bunnet in here that has love me right here that you can tie it around your head here's a scarf you can use to tie around your head as well a edge comb slash brush and they sent over this extra box for me as an influencer so it had beauty blenders in here the same hair ties that you already saw a letter a brush set a eye mask there was also this comb heating comb I love those and there was also a robe in here look at the robe and it has love me right here so thank you for the extra love me so this is the wig right here it is a beautiful wig look at the highlights in this wig guys it is a closure it is pre-plucked pre-bleached it is a middle part it has two cones on the side an adjustable strap and a band to wear it glueless so let's just hop straight into the install which will be pretty simple because it's a closure i'm going to take my foundation and tint the lace i do this so that i don't have any flashback or anything when i take pictures so i have the wig on we're going to adjust it and see how it fit on the head it's a really good fit i always do this to make sure my part is in the middle i'm going to take my wax stick and move everything out to the way so i can see what i am working with this wig I do feel like could have been plucked a little bit more but for the way you're going to wear it, you're really not going to be able to tell. So I pinned it up. I'm going to take my Got To Be Glue Gel. I link everything that I use below and I'm going to put one layer on it and I'm going to dry it with my dryer. So after it is tacky, we're going to just go ahead and pull this down and push it to the head and tie it up really, really good. And I'm just using a band. You guys, I love Love Me Hair. I love the quality, the density, the everything of their wigs. I'm just taking the even spray and I'm going to melt the lace, but this spray is just doing the most, but we're going to make it work. But like I was saying, I love this company so much. I have reviewed for them numerous of times and I've never had a bad wig. I love the way the wigs are made. I love the density in them. I just love the packaging, everything about the company. So right here, I am cutting off the lace. I'm going to leave a little bit of space because this will make my lace lay down a little bit better and longer. So I'm just taking some very small scissors and cutting that off. And then I'm going to go in with a little bit of the even spray on the end of my comb and push that in and tie it down again. So if this is not your cup of tea, they have all type of wigs over there. I love that they have beginner user friendly wigs. I have so many people I know in real life that love these wigs because they are so beginner friendly or like anybody can just put them on and go. You get what I'm saying? So we're going to just comb this out to see what we're working with. And it is gorgeous, guys, the curls and everything. And this is really gorgeous. While you're over there on the website, guess what? They do have split and quad pay options. If you don't want to pay for your wig up front, and they do have so many other different type of wigs to choose from. I really love their bob wigs as well. So I'm just brushing through it so the combs aren't too tight. Just making everything look a little neat. And yeah, that's it, guys. I will leave the link to this wig below along with a discount code. Don't forget to check them out.
It's your little to the one that looks just like to you for her age and we're starting a new vlog. Yeah, yesterday I just had to. I am having some moments. So, um, yesterday I was invited to three, you probably can tell you by the way this wig look, it look like I just threw it on. Galentine's Day events. I didn't go to neither one. I was already having a hard time trying to figure out which one to go to because they all was like between six and seven. So, and I'll spread it out. But yesterday, I just was not in the mood to socialize, to fake happy, to, I, I wasn't in the mood. So, I just stayed at home anyway. I got fresh flowers. You guys saw that. We did the perfume tray. I did get new pillows, too, but I'm waiting on the cases to come for them and for them to, it said it take 24 hours. Um, these are supposed to be some good firm pillows. <laughs> I guess they are. I'm going to give them the full 24 hours or they going back. I'll link them below, though. Um, and, yeah, let's just get this vlog started. Hopefully, my mood elevates. Um, I don't know what's going on with my mood lately. I honestly don't know. It's just in and out, in and out, in and out. But this is funny. I wanted to show you guys this. I'll just insert the picture, guys. This came up in my memories on Facebook. And this was approximately, I'm going to insert the picture, here you guys go. This was approximately 1999, and this is the denim jacket that I always wear. And so it was just so funny to me because every time I wear that jacket, you guys are always like, um, where did you get it? And I was like, it's a jacket I've been having since high school. I literally cut up, shredded, and it, it's still going strong. So that's that jacket right there that was just too funny to me. When I posted that, a lot of you guys was like, that was my freshman year in college. A lot of you guys was like, oh, you got me curious to want to see more throwback pictures. So I started posting on Instagram and my stories. Then, y'all, I'm going to start a journey. I want to get back to this size. This was at Drake's. Um, Nicole and I went to Drake's to eat in August 2021. And so, I maintained this weight for a minute, and then I, I've gained. So, this is 12 pounds lighter. It, 12 pounds make a big difference. I look so much smaller. I want to try to get back to that weight, so we're going to work on that this vlog. And I'm trying to see if there's anything else. Y'all, I have screenshotted stuff to tell y'all in my phone. I guess that's it. So, we're going to see what we can get popping. I have been in this gown two days I'm gonna mellow out for a couple of more days and then we'll try to get some stuff popping I really hate I miss those events but y'all if you if you suffer from anxiety or seasonal depression or anything like that you know how hard it is to fake happy around people and the shit about to make me cry Uh, I think I told y'all before that a lot of those events and stuff, I, I really don't be having fun. Um, I just have to go and work. So, I just couldn't even force myself this week. I couldn't. I kind of, I'm in this isolated stage where, like, I just want to be shut off. I don't want to have to deal with the world, people. Even my own house. Um, so glad Shug's boyfriend is here because it won't look away. I just want to be in my room away and get my thought process together so love you guys let's get this vlog on okay guys i came back let me put some on these lips guys <laughs> i can't i look pale on them maybe it's the light because i don't look pale in this mirror um uh, because i do want to i always want to touch on something and this is my platform so i feel like i can do as i please so if the ranting or the deep talks like this aggravate you i do have a makeup channel if you want to watch tutorials or um, feel free to just exit the room silently. Uh, announcement is not needed. Um, 
I do want to touch on something because it's been sitting on my heart a lot. This might truly backfire on me. It might truly backfire on me, but at this point, I always say I'm a grown woman and it doesn't matter. Um, I just want... It's been so much negativity going. It's like every time I turn on my phone, YouTube, Instagram, it's like gossip about somebody or people praise it. Like, I think the Charles and Miss Netta situation is one of them because all Miss Netta do is fix her man a plate every day. And she done had to go through people talking about her skin, her weight, how she built, how she act. And they are genuinely nice people in person. Um... So, it's just a lot of bullying by adults. Like, I told y'all I'm really emotional this week, so if I start crying. Um, it's just a lot of bullying and stuff going on by grown adults that's getting exhausting. So, the point of me saying, all right, let me just get straight to the chases. I, um, YouTube, I see a lot of that going on on YouTube. And just like rap beef, I feel like the fans is the ones that rile that up. And just like YouTube beef, I feel like the subscribers is the ones that rile that up, right? And etc. And a lot of that stuff that gets reported isn't true. Um, when people don't respond to certain things, y'all feel like they automatically guilty of it. Um, it's people who have never done anything to people on here. But they get dogged like they have because the other person spiraled or told they side you know all that kind of stuff and i said all that to say because i have been getting a lot of messages right and if you're one of these people leaving me these messages feel free to chime in in the comments because i ain't never been no b in my blood um you guys will write me and you'll say i see everybody doing a punchline at the beginning of that video i see everybody turning up before they get dressed i see everybody doing a perfume tray now and i skip over it I skip over it. I have proof. So if anybody say I'm lying, I will drop receipts. Because that's stirring up drama to me. So I feel like all you want. So I feel like if I say, mm-hmm, or sure is. Or, now y'all have the right to say, she said it too, or she agreed to it. And no, that's stirring up drama. First of all, if somebody want to do a perfume trail, whatever, that's fine. I would wholeheartedly love if they say, I got this idea from playing them D, but unfortunately, it's not going to happen all the time. I'm an influencer, and I can influence other influencers. I don't have a problem with that. That's fine. It's going to happen. Do I have a problem with that? It bothers me a little, but I don't have a problem with it. It's going to happen. What bothers me is when grown women throw it in my face to like rile me up about it. We see what's going on, There's, it's not a need. So I said all that to say like, stop rallying stuff up. I've seen so many YouTube, I've been on here a long time. I've seen so many Instagram situations riled up strictly by the subscribers. Like that person didn't even say that, that person didn't even feel that way, but y'all let a subscriber or a channel or something rile it up and that's not even the T. Like, if I really got on here, if I really got on here and exposed, like, the real about some of these situations, some of these companies, y'all, stop letting the subscribers. And if you are a new YouTuber, let me tell you something. Connect with other YouTubers, but stop getting in these little groups talking about people. You trying to grow your channel. You already starting off wrong. There shouldn't be a need to where you and a group of small micro influencers and y'all all trying to help each other build each other channel and y'all discussing what I'm doing. Y'all discussing what Gina doing. Y'all discussing what Chelsea doing. Y'all discussing what Dane. Like, y'all trying to get there. And gossiping is not going to get you there. And please believe in those small groups. They fall out like the big ones. And then her go the people in those small groups telling the people what they said about them. We all grown and should just start making better decisions. You know, like life is hard enough. Everything is going up but the pay. People struggling. I just saw a man, they rescued off a bridge right close to me. 
He lost his job, didn't have family here, couldn't find another job, couldn't pay rent, lost all his possessions, and was finna jump off that bridge and somebody came from behind him and like, life is hard enough, stop instigating. We call that instigating where I'm from. We call that starting sh where I'm from. Stop it. If you're gonna be in my inbox, it need to be a prayer, it need to be something positive. You, If it's under a picture, oh, I love that wig, I love that look, I love that makeup. Do not. I'm going to start blocking. Because it's malicious and it's mean. Come in my inbox. I see everybody doing. You're starting stuff. My life is complicated enough. Then. Whoa. We got a big one from Dossier. Thank you so much. I will link the below. They sent two candles. You guys know I am in love with their new candles. So let's just see the scents on them. This is Ambery Vanilla, inspired by YSL Black Opium. One of my favorite scents from them. Oh, their candles are big. They come packaged really nicely. Mmm, that's, oh my gosh, that smells so freaking good. Uh-oh, I stuck my finger in that. Yeah, they are two weak, two weak, two weak candles, and they are bomb. We have another um, Aromatic Star Nice inspired by Dior Sauvage. You know I love that one. Let me show you the one I'm currently burning, child. Let me just show it to you. Look how low it is. Yeah. Bum. Bum. Get this candle. For real. Yeah, I didn't even get perfume. So, y'all know I love their diffuser. So, I always, well, they always send me. This is Ambery Vanilla. My favorite one. You know, I have them all over the house, probably in three spots, not all over. Two in my room, one in my bathroom. This one is Flora Marshmallow, inspired by I Love Don't Be Shy. Mm. Let's look at this. It is super neat. It is a discovery set. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. I want to scream because do you know how this is going to come in handy when I travel? When I travel? Like what? So let's go over the fragrances really, really quick. Of course, my boo is number one. Ambery Saffron inspired by Baccarat. Ambery Vanilla inspired by YSL Black Opium. Aromatic Star Nice inspired by Dior Sauvage. Bubbly and Spritz, inspired by their own Speak, Eagle, Speak Easy collection. I want to smell this. I've never smelled that. This one right here is Caramelized Almond and Hazelnut. This is their genderless collection. This one right here is Floral Marshmallow, inspired by Love Don't Be Shy. Fruity Almond, inspired by Carolina Herrera Good Girl. This is Musky Oak Moss, inspired by Creed Eventus. Rose and Basil Bliss, that's from their wellness collection. And this one is Woody Sandalwood, inspired by Le Labo 13. I mean, no, 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 no. Le Labo Santal 33. Wow. Wow. That CA will be linked below. Yeah, as if life isn't puzzling enough right now, I just got a notification from the credit reporting agency that my score dropped significantly. 29 points it almost took me there yeah so i go on there i'm like what the heck happened because one thing i don't do is play about paying my bills child a hospital bill from 2020 when the pandemic first started when they misdiagnosed me with GERD hit and during that time i was in this rough patch where nicole had dropped me off her insurance and i was trying to get my own so the bill hit so I was going to dispute it because I was misdiagnosed. I never heard it had GERD. I had parasites. Um, but I called them and I was like, bro, I didn't even know hospital bills could still hit your credit. But I guess to avoid HIPAA and get around that, I, I don't know how they get around it. Anyway, so um, they settled for a third. So I paid the bill. 
so my credit could go back up but let me tell y'all i feel like credit is such a scam because one bill hit my credit and it took me into a panic state because you guys know i recently lost my wallet so i'm like oh my gosh is somebody going crazy with my credit one bill dropped my credit 29 points bro but if you pay a car off they just gonna raise it like 15 20 points if you pay a credit card off they like credit is such a scam but anyway it's taken care of so by next cycle i guess when it falls off it should be back but yeah i had to pay it out of pocket and that's scary because i was really sick that year and went to the hospital a lot and don't remember getting insurance to like november-ish maybe october so maybe june maybe june so i don't know how many more bills that might happen with but anyway i just got out the shower so we're gonna put on a light scent this is versace bright crystal absolute this is a very gorgeous daytime scent oh, that smells so good it has a hint of sweetness to it oh, what's in here i need to start researching what's in my stuff but y'all know i don't care as long as it smells good this smells extremely good let me know if you have this and if you have bright crystal yeah the clear pink one which one you like the most all right guys so that's pulling really floral tonight so i decided to look it up and it's the peonies i'm smelling loud tonight that's crazy it's a fruity floral yuzu whatever that is lemon raspberry amber pomegranate juice and a musk in here so you get the really hold on because my gown smell good yeah that floral is pulling hard rural hard but it's a fruity floral there wasn't any sun today so i looked on youtube and it told me a hack to open these and oh the pillowcases came so this is what we have right here Gina's playing in the background. She's super excited. She got her Range Rover back. <laughs> and this is what I spray. And this is what I spray to keep my room smelling good. But only on the decorative pillows, of course. Not on where I am going to actually... Not on where I am going to actually lay my head. Just some little... And you can do the blanket, too, because... I can do the blanket too. I even spray these pillows over here. Even though that's hidden strong. Strong. So I have one right there. One right there. And I do have one over there in my tub. Hey guys. So it's been a moment. Um, it's been about three days since I picked this camera up. I've been to the hospital and everything. So I think the last couple, the last vlog, I was telling y'all how I just didn't feel well. And I kept, you know, trying to self-hydrate and all of that. Um, I even took COVID tests and everything if I left that in that vlog. And I just wasn't feeling well. Well, Saturday morning, I tried to get up and it's like my head didn't want to come up from the pillow child. So, um, yeah. I'm just going to be transparent. One of my good, 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 good exes was like, nah, that's not right. Get up. You ain't been feeling yourself. Something ain't right. Worst case scenario, you don't want to be having no stroke or nothing. Get up. I mean, not get up, but came and got me took me to the ER, stayed with me at the ER all day, took me back to their house so that I could be watched throughout the night because my daddy can't help me. He's sickly himself and should just, I be texting and everything. She barely be responding. And so he just wanted to make sure I was safe. And if that, if that wasn't enough, um, got up meal prepped for me so I have healthy foods that he eat all week in case this is a food digestive issue all of the tests were clear of course blood scans ekgs everything was clear 
So they're assuming that it's like stress related. So, um, thank you so much because I know he watched me. Um, I'm like, is this supposed to be my husband? <laughs> but he had a chance and he messed up. Now. <laughs> But no, I'm going to pick up my medicine. It was ready yesterday, but y'all slept out of They gave me some, had me out like a light. I was so drowsy at his house, and it was Super Bowl Sunday. I felt bad, so I was like, you can take me home. And I, was, I ain't doing nothing but sleeping and go out and have fun with your boys or your girl or whoever you dating up right now. Or whatever you're doing. I, just, I felt bad, like, you don't have to stay in because I'm down. Um, so I didn't go get my medicine yesterday, so that's where I'm headed now, is to get my medicine, and then I'm going to Walgreens. I got 10 packs of tissue for $20. You put in, you clip both coupons, you put in 10 Scott products, clip both coupons, add a code in. Oh, by the time this video go live, it ain't gonna even matter. The sale gonna be over. So, I got tissue. I got a stockpile. I just keep so I don't... Y'all remember when I was buying all that washing? Laundry detergent. Still got it. <sighs> Child, I'm lost. This is um, Angel Nova. I don't remember the last time, but I don't care. Like, I'm lost. <laughs> I ain't used nothing on the tray. Then guess I'm getting flued out tomorrow. Valentine's Eve. So, I'm trying to prep my stuff up so that I can make this flight. Um yeah, I'm getting flued out tomorrow. So this is supposed to be a totally separate video. I was supposed to cover Friday, Saturday, and Sunday and today in this video and then start another video when I get flued out. But guess what? I got sick. So it's all gonna be one video. Maybe I might break it up into two. Let's just go and pick this stuff up, y'all. Take care of yourselves. That just brought me back to something. I have both of these on the tray, and I almost think they smell identical. I don't want to spray my skin, so I'm going to spray this jacket. This is Mancera's Juicy Flower. nothing to like. <laughs> Maybe I should put this on the floor. Twenty dollars. The ten packs of nine. Maybe it's six. Nope. Oh. It's twelve. My minutes. Big old sheet from the hospital. Let me see how much I weigh. Too goddamn much. I'm on a weight loss journey as well. So I'm going to show y'all this sheet. Whoop, it ain't on here. I'm going to pull from when I went to the doctor last and put it in here. And then we're going to weigh. I get back from my vacation. Cause I've been out of line. Girl, I still got all them stickers and stuff on me. And I done took two, three of these. Let me get some oil and get that off of me. This is my extra little dump all closet and it looked like I should have been getting paper towels. But I put them down here. Baby, is it my house or everybody has to do paper towels like this? So I wanted to come back and update y'all. I don't know what I was going to get when I got this, um, but somebody said that this smelled like something. It was, was it Delina? It can't be Delina, this is way too fruity. And so that's what made me get it. And it is, if you want to smell like candy, or fruity, juicy, Jolly Rancher or something like that, this is definitely your scent. Definitely a daytime, flirty, I smell like, sweet candied apple even it might not be apple in here so i don't want to say that um type fragrance that's what this is very very good this is my favorite um what's the brand new glare 
that's my favorite new glare scent guys i really thought i was getting pranked today because i got this package right here it's just a it's just a plain white envelope and then off the side of this package was this that i'm gonna keep because it's plain and i can mail something in it and then it's a card from finery it say you're our you're so fine finery fragrance and it say as your valentine we want you to feel fine indulge in these luxurious and embark on a sensorial journey and that's it i emailed him and said what happened y'all being funny and i was like it was a mix up in the warehouse and um a box is coming to me so let me show you what i already have from them this is my favorite one from them it's called sweet on the outside got something on it this is my favorite scent this smells like billy eilish if you have billy eilish and you love that scent oh that smells so freaking good these are 29 or you can get the spray for 14. i can't wait to see what they're gonna send me but i was like sus y'all pranking me <laughs> so i watched someone on instagram and they suffer from hydro or something i don't know they be getting balls and stuff all the time under their arms and their bottom area and stuff and they always use this cream this ointment this came from canada so it took a minute to get here the name of the company is called my magic healer i got the sample size because this is high i think a full jar well no i'm not gonna put no price on nobody's stuff it's it's fairly pricey a full jar is sixty dollars and this little sample that i got is 28. so i feel like i feel like the sample is perfect because why would i pay sixty dollars on a full jar or something i don't even know if it's gonna work for me i don't have that problem <laughs> let's be clear about that but um i do get this from shaving so remember when I did my last feminine hygiene video? What the heck? I was telling y'all to use the Dermalogica down there to avoid this. So she said you could put this down there after you like shave and stuff to uh, prevent ingrowns and all of that kind of stuff. And then it's like for so many things, guys. Like so many things. Um, daily, You can use it as a daily moisturizer. Drying cracked skin, chapped lips, infected eczema, underskin, cystic acne red inflammation painful bumps open sores boils abscess all that kind of stuff so if i could just tell the truth i really got it because like <laughs> sis be struggling and she did a video crying and she sold me on the ointment so i got it through her link to support her <laughs> hey might be the best thing for me um, she be putting it all on her face baby we go go in with it because this little joke is 28 dollars okay by the way here's an update on my flowers they did bloom but there's no sun in here and i've been sick so i haven't been able to sit them in the sun so they already like dying <laughs> water's really low maybe i should put water in them to try to bring them back to life so i got a bag let me show y'all my bag Woo, isn't she lovely it was the sponsor for my last vlog though check that video out all right guys so that's a beautiful bag right i love teddy blake they have like the it girl look for a fraction of the price and i have been focusing on trying to get bags that don't have hardware i mean you know they don't have a colored hardware like um gold or silver because a lot of times when i go to go out i want to wear a certain bag but can't because i have on silver and the hardware to the bag i want to wear is gold or vice versa so i tried to pick a bag that doesn't have like any hardware color to it so that'll be linked below i'm gonna take me up no it's seven o'clock i'm about to pack i all right guys here's our outfit fit my nikki shirt again these jeans right here came from shein i was gonna do ugg boots but it's gonna warm up so i just put the crocs on it looks weird because these jeans are so short but whatever we're just going to the airport I'm nerves bad or something. 
We're gonna put on Sailors, Sailors and Sirens from Juice Box. This is a mixture to me, in my eyes. It smells like, I'll tell y'all in a minute. Cause I was gonna say something, but it ain't smelling like that right now. I first initially sprayed it at the scent room. It very much puts me in the mind of Fumi Monet's Exalte. Some people say Delina, I, I don't get that. The roses, I smell the roses in it, but child, I don't get Delina. Oh, I just got it in everywhere. Mm, maybe a little of it. Girl, my nails is pulling up. How long have I had these on? All right. So this tells me I should pack another set because I don't have extras to these. I'm gonna go get a set of nails. Yeah, I got some more flowers. Oh, this ain't flowers. It might as well be though, God dang. Hello, Mrs. Now Sephora. Got a headband, you know, to pull your hair back to wash your face. My favorite marine cream. I have all oh, my packs. I am running solo on these and my cleansing balm. Boy, thank you so much, Elemis. I ain't playing. Let's see. I was kind of scared if this was flowers. I'm like, I'm going to have to pot them. Then I was like, I just tell should to do it. Yeah, I'm valet and they, pro they protest. What they protesting for? You don't know? Oh, yeah. He said, his name, his name Benny, he ain't in it. <laughs> okay. Huh? A new contract. Oh, okay. I'm nosy. <laughs> Y'all, I'm carrying some bum ass. Beep, 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 beep. I had to go to the back for a thorough search. I had to take my pants off and everything. Tell me, you see that red dot? It's something right there. Yeah, a fupa. A vagina. Yeah. My suitcase was over one pound and they made me repack it. So I took my jewelry out. And that'll do it. <laughs> that'll do it. My daddy gave me all these masks. Do I have on one? Absolutely not. So let me situate myself. I don't even know where I'm supposed to be. Y'all, this shirt is a conversation starter, but I didn't tell y'all. After I showed y'all the first time, the company reached out to me. I guess the sales influxed and so they searched and found where it was coming from. That deal wasn't right. It makes me want to take, they link out the videos I've already mentioned them because what? What? I mean, the deal was God awful. Like, child, please. Like, don't even disrespect me like that. Then they go try to do me on a commission only. I said, no. They told myself, we got to make sure that it's profitable for both of us. It's already been profitable to, to you. I showed y'all just out of GP. And y'all found me. Y'all better know y'all work. Just like did y'all see all them Timu ass doing the Super Bowl? Baby, Timu pay me good. <laughs> I don't play, they pay me good. So if they ain't paying y'all, reconsider. More technology. I hate when I be having to throw my stuff away. Now I gotta pay for water. I'ma just get a Sprite. They trying to tell y'all something. The butts be stinking. Guys, I figured it out, I smell like gentle fluidy gum vanilla rose royale what is it called mancera roses vanilla i smell so freaking good it's spicy but vanilla rosy Y'all want me to tell y'all what a hater is? Go fly me in. 
for Valentine's Day, so can't nobody get none for me. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> but in reality, um, I came, you know, this is the day her sister passed away. So I came down here to be with her. Cause why the fuck not? They about the only place that's more countryer than Texas. Okay, okay. Look at the good tolls. Lord, they inspected me. They inspected my luggage. What's going on here? She got an attitude. You got an attitude? Yeah, look at my cone and her glasses. <laughs> <laughs> look at little cone. First up, we're going to Dodge's fried chicken. I'm not going to get no chicken though. But, yeah. You're not going to get nothing? All right, guys, so I told Nicole that she never, when I used to come to Nashville when we were married, she never took me to the hot spot, so it's a challenge for her. So she done brought me to this place called Dodgers Chicken because they chicken and snacks be good. And she used to always eat here before we even got married. We go, I'll be the judge when we get back to the room. Got a burrito, pizza roll. <laughs> that's your, that's that an apple pie? Uh, strawberry cream. Strawberry cream. This is, I hope you put my ranch in here. Rotisserie rings, I don't see the ranch. Let me see if they got some last time. I don't need it. I was trying to keep it on the side. Oh. The yeah, we got a free. Burrito anyway, huh? <laughs> we set up my clothes thing ain't filled at all. Then all the stuff is at the bottom. I said that's all. I ain't, we in Nashville, I ain't trying to. This ain't New York Fashion Week now. Don't start. It. Valentine's Day, guys. So we have this sweater dress on from Shein. I thought it was Harsh Child. I don't know what. Peak boots and this bag. And we will be wearing Ka'ali Sweet Diamond Pink Pepper. I'm actually headed to a lake, so I'm going to take Crocs. Because I brought tennis shoes, but they blinged out, so don't want to wear them at the lake either. We off to a late start. It's my fault, though. It's 2 o'clock. This is one of the cult favorites. But it's not one of mine. I just brought it because it was on the tray. It gives me very much sweet oud. It's oud in this. It gotta be because I smell it so hard. It's good though, but it's not one of my favorites. My pinks don't really match, but they gonna match today. I forgot to tell y'all I brought the dossier. Um, or not oils, since out of that Discovery set, they are perfect for travel. Amber Saffron, Baccarat Inspired, Amber Vanilla YSL Black Opiate Inspired. Well, that's strong. Nicole, way low with her fan, and that's, that's strong. All I put on was concealer and mascara and gloss to wake me up, but shit, it damn near made me look big. I have no volume to my face. Right. I got me a gift, y'all. Huh? We could go to both parts. I'm gonna ask this man, let me try the boot. Yow, it's some boots. Some pink boots. <laughs> now, this is what I have a question about. When y'all see this water right here, we'll stop it from coming on and taking over the universe. God is amazing. I think it's amazing because see even down there look it want to come on up and take over Tennessee and flood it out like a tsunami 
It get a sparkly boat. It's all iridescent. <laughs> he waiting. I don't see what he gonna do. He giving us a lesson. He said this is the worst lake in Tennessee. <laughs> <laughs> he said he's just he just needed to change his motor. I didn't. I don't ever think to record, but I don't like putting everybody on camera either. So. <laughs> It's really my fault because I flat out lied and he said, y'all taking pictures. I'm talking like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we just, sorry, sir. Hello. 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 We just here we just looking at the water. <laughs> I just caught one bag. Oh, let me hand I it. I fried it up with some mm -hmm. Texas Pete, which was sued. Did you know that? I just found that out watching Gina. Somebody sued Texas Pete and won because it's not made in Texas. Now, Gina, did you do your research on that before you had me on this blog looking <laughs> dumb? <laughs> hey. Jump out to that rock. Here, hold the camera. All right. <laughs> Bro, look at these fat ass ducks. Especially that one. He eat all the food who came to this end. It's called the Friendship Bridge. Oh, that's perfect. It's in Chinese. <laughs> they so in love, y'all. Ain't the only person in heels. <laughs> she got me down here with the deers. Ain't no deer down here. And I'm in heels. They real comfortable though, y'all. Get some pictures. It's gonna be ugly though, cause that ain't even no cute background, huh? <laughs> Don't do it, huh? Cause that's where Chuck E. Cheese was at. We can't wait over here. Yes, we were gonna go to Chuck E. Cheese and it's gone. <laughs> it's literally gone. I mean, we done fought traffic and everything. False alarm, she was in the wrong shopping center. It's open. Look, we finna have a time, but I forgot I'm on medicine and where I gotta go. <laughs> Y'all, I'm finna blow these people establishment up. They gonna say, girl, girl, get up the fuck up out of here. Oh, well, we only got an hour. They got a fruit ninja, but he on he or she. Let me do this a couple of times. I wish we got our own cars, huh? Oh, here. Tickets go. I think they all on here now. Okay, well you get us some tickets and I'ma go to the restroom. I wouldn't stop until I won, my boy. Oh it don't pick up on the camera. Come look. <laughs> Go crazy. <laughs> so I heard one of the new pistachio finery fragrances was spotted in Nashville. Ain't no hurry. Pockets and bowls got it. But y'all, I'm confused. How did they build this target? That's what I need to know. Because when you walk in and go to groceries, the child, they don't have it. They barely got the regular sense. Picked over. <laughs> okay, maybe it's in the package they're sending me. Yes, the fuck they do. <laughs> We're gonna do a live on camera reaction. Now that bubble guts is helping. <laughs> it drained me. And then the toilet went flush. But when nobody up in that 
Chuck E. Cheese. One person, huh? Two. By the time we like. By the time we let. Ooh! That smell good. You smell it? Oh my gosh. It don't smell like y'all know I do not like Kali um pistachio gelato. Oh, I like this a lot. A lot lots. Pistachio milk, fluffy vanilla, and taco bean. When I put milk and stuff, what does milk smell like? Milk. She hate when I say milk. I like it, y'all, a lot. You do Donnie. Woo! They did they big one. They do they big one on all they sense though. Alright guys, we got the infamous favorite dress in pinky purple. It looks very similar to the red one that I wore on the cruise. <laughs> Hold on, I'm trying to show you. It has the split here. And the split there as well. This gold purse from Shein. Oh, this is Shein. The shoes are Shein. The earrings. The earrings very much give Mahi collection. Y'all, this week is thickest. I wear it all the time. You're nice, but I definitely need to wash it. Oh, shit. It's dry, and I ain't got time to. But I love this week. Just. Mm. We're going to go ahead and try the new finery. This is brand new. Brand, brand spiking new. Can't even get it on their website yet. Target website, nobody. Just gotta look up and find it. All right, guys, you know, every time we're here, I have to come to Chop House. I'm really not feeling it. I even asked her if she wanted to Uber some food because for one, I started a new medication and it got me really drowsy and it's running through my stomach so i'm not gonna be able to enjoy it but i'm gonna try are you ready mm -hmm. No, the light is crooked. Ready? Okay. Okay. 10 out of 10, I go hit. What'd you give it? 10. Baby. <laughs> what nothing left on our place. <laughs> like we ain't ate all day. That don't make no dang sense. <laughs> I'm cold, y'all trying to be cute. Well, I actually just left my jacket. Y'all know. But, but there's too much skin that I'm cold. <laughs> yeah, 10 out of 10. I had shrimp. It was like shrimp scampi, but I didn't eat the pasta and the butter. Crab cake, potato, no bacon, no salt. And, uh, what you call? Salmon. Salmon. Y'all say salmon. Salmon, 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 salmon. My mama say salmon to everything. <laughs> salmon. You what your mama say? Salmon. Salmon. Now who done brought they stanky ass on this elevator for? I'm mad about it. Baby, this hotel must be like the after hours or something. It is lit down there. Like the whole parking lot is lit and then it's like a little restaurant bar down there. But I was like this. But I need to put my head up because when I came through the door, they was like. Y'all see how they came in through the door? They was like, what you think I tried? I charged a hot 40 or something? Charge me. Let me. But I had to look up because the coat, I don't have on a jacket either. She just went by her mama house to get some um medicine. And I stayed in because I don't have no jacket and it's gonna drop to 30 degrees. Her mama actually came out to the car. I was like, I'm so sorry, you know, I'm not really like that, but if I ain't got no coat on. Get the damn door open. How I open this door? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I said, I walk there like this. Get the 
Cause I don't nobody don't know about don't know about the trumpet tonight though. Like try pimp and P tonight. Play a P Sue. Not on the cold watch, huh? No. Girl, I, I can go have me a little date. I can't go down to the lobby and have me a little drink with the guy. Look, how she gonna be how she gonna be saying it, but in the car I said, come on in here so the people can see your face. In the car, I said, what if I would have texted you and said, I got me a boo, I got a date, I ain't going to come. What you going to say? Okay. Exactly. That don't have to, but you, but you here right now. <laughs> <laughs> so since I'm here, I can't go have a drink. Go not have a drink. What you going to do? I'm going to sit in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, my makeup look a mess up close because I had like a little light concealer beat and I was lazy and didn't take that off and put foundation over it. Uh, uh. It got the job done, but baby. Whew. All right. We in. It's 10.30. I got me some bunt cake. She got me a carrot cake. And my favorites. Y'all see me post. You gotta be a bold mother to ask somebody for a Reese piece and know only two come in a pack. And all my favorites in here, y'all. Step to a slip. Oh no, this ain't no slip gym now. Jack Links. And she set up and let me door dash ginger ale last night. Knowing it was something in his bag. Shanae. You should have just said, I'll go get you something in the morning. But I knew you needed it last night. Look, I got some on my dress. All right, this dress looks very burgundy, like the one I had on on the boat. Look at my little fat back in. Hold on, hold on. Put my little fat back in. Oh, let me go in Let me get him a cusser while you go there for the forks. Chick-fil-A that sells the burgers, but they don't sell the burgers anymore as a, what was it, May last year? So that's out. So I saw Gina go to the African American Museum and we were gonna do that, but it's like, we're not literally, we're not actually in Nashville. So it's like a drive and it's just like too much back and forth because baby, where is all this traffic coming from? And so I was like, we both like one today anyway. Don't have to drive way over there. So we're just gonna go grab some more Dodgers cause those rotisserie ones were good and chill today. And then go to Hibachi tonight. So Nicole liked the other shirt that say Nikki better, which I do too. So I'm gonna keep this one. Then that it say Platinum D you can advertise for me. So I'm just putting this back on. I'm just, because I brought it. This as a day fit from Shein. You know, I got these basic dresses. Um, but I need to order all of these basic dresses over without this. Damn! You heard that? Yeah. Them, uh, them turtlenecks about to kill me, don't they? I, my body temperature. That'd be a little too hot for me. And I, I can't do it. So we're gonna put on, um, we're just going to a gas station, literally. 
This is Ambery Vanilla from Bassier. Ooh, this smells so good. It smells like my room because y'all know I have the diffusers in my room. These little things come in handy. So the whole thing is $99. I think I showed it to you. I was sort of real that I did. But Dossier I always have like these little sales, so it'll go in your car for $89. So if you if you go in your car for $89 and they take the $10 off, you can't use my code. You've already got a discount. Because a lot of people write me and say my code is not working. And my code works when you're buying the items at regular price. They're not going to stack a discount on top of a discount. Some sites do, but Dossier said no ma'am. So, oh, this smells good. Yeah, it's dead deers everywhere. We spotted two of them, and I said, I'm gonna pull the camera out and let it run. Y'all know now we're not finna see an deer, because I wanna see a deer. Bag secured, honey. It's absolutely crazy how the human body changed because regular Gatorades now make me sick. Like it's too much something in them. So I have to get the sugar free and I have to dilute them with water. Y'all, I need to get my nose hers trim. Please don't be thinking my nose dirty because I'm very particular about how I look on camera now. But, um, woo. The last time I cut my nose hairs, y'all had a fit. That's what stopped you from getting sick. That's what, and I know y'all be like, just trim them, but child. Did I want to add what in the drink? Jojo's. Jojo's. I said, what is a Jojo? <laughs> What's a Jojo? That's the potato whip. You didn't even know. Don't try to act like you know now. Know. <laughs> You're not doing your duty. What you oh, supposed I'm to sorry. do when we I'm go over a bump? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that be hurting, y'all. Okay, let me find y'all up here. Yeah, last night when I was talking about the men, I was playing. Clearly, I was playing. Hence, how fast I was walking through that lava with my head down. I don't want nobody to say nothing to me. I don't want no dates, no drinks. I was just joking. Because we all know, Nicole, what they'll be saying. <laughs> Nicole, go ahead, throw and use. You missed it. <laughs> I missed the deer. Tell him you know everything I do and you don't be tripping. Let, I ain't gonna even narrate it for you. Let it, you can, they, you can hear it. Y'all can hear it out there. I know everything. She tell me everything. I, I'm okay with it. Whatever she feel like she needs to do. Oh, the other one was up there. Yeah, because they, I had to address it. I had to leave a comment on the commentary page. They talking about some why would I be sending you those pictures and you say my New Year's Eve pictures the ones that was on Instagram. <laughs> I'm like the pictures on Instagram. <laughs> yeah. I'm sad too. Uh, we just we show our sadness two totally different ways. We I talk every day. We talk all day. <laughs> all day. She I probably get on her nerves. Do I get on your nerves? All the time. Tree cause when Nicole be delivering, she be sending me pictures and videos. Well, do you be sending me videos? The, the dudes be about to attack her ass when she dropping off these people's stuff. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you don't get scared. Yeah, yeah, just hurry up, get my ass back in my car. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be out there giving their ass a show. Cause it be like five or six of them at a time. It don't just be one. No, one time used to be one, it was about 30 in the picture. Yeah. Like y'all really want to see a deer? I'm just dramatic as f I act like y'all. Yeah. Ooh, I see them. They can't see them. They down in the crack. Ooh, look at that one. Ooh. Ooh, three in a row. Three in a row. <laughs> Dang. It's like deer is kind of slow too, and I mean that like remedial slow. Like they get scared and run straight into what's gonna kill them, or run straight and jump off a cliff, don't they? 
Like a deer headlights, that's where they came from. Yeah, because they're free. They don't know what to do. Third day here, and look what I discovered. They got a whole cookie oven. <laughs> Downstairs, self-serve. I ain't got a job in Boston in Houston. I had to keep going down there. Can I have cookie? Can I have cookie? But, but they got three kinds, don't they? Raisin, chocolate chip, and and uh sugar. Baby, it's still in the oven. You just get the little thing and take them out yourself. Let me get, let me get that you been eating it? Yeah, that's why I'm It ain't really warm. The oven was real hot. Mm -hmm. uh, is it warm to you? Yeah. I gotta get Lucas to eat, y'all. Oh, let me show y'all before I get me. Because I don't want to waste nothing on this and I gotta wear it home. Mm -hmm. This smell like rotisserie rings. Mm -hmm. I just got some wings. They rotisserie rings, you know, like the. Well, y'all know what a rotisserie chicken is now. Now don't don't get on here acting like y'all don't know nothing. <laughs> the ones they be fighting over at Walmart and stuff when they bring them out. I be like, dang, but people meal prep and stuff with them chickens. <sighs> They be standing in line waiting on the fresh one. Don't let you be like the first in line and grab like five. Everybody behind you want to fight. Well, I'm getting fully undressed in this one dog. <laughs> this is one diamond member downstairs, y'all. He's so happy he can park in the front right. He couldn't even check in. He had to go shit, didn't he? <laughs> the lady kept trying to tell us that he was like, he's like, I'm going to just leave my luggage right here. I got to go. Like, golly, shit the booty boy. All right, guys, so this is what we got going on tonight. Shirt sheen, skirt sheen, and yeah, my necklace is um, Tiffany & Co. It has the pink splatter. It's like a limited edition one. My Louis Vuitton and Amazon bracelet. That's what I have going on right there. This hat came from the beauty supply, and these boots came from Shoe Deal. Yeah, this hotel is something else, ain't it? <laughs> me and just straight up stealing beer and soda ain't that now. <laughs> then he gonna come over and I start posing with me, huh? <laughs> yeah. No, sir, we saw you steal that beer. <laughs> we did. <laughs> but I ain't no snitch. Snitches end up in ditches with snitch ditches. <laughs> so I am just walk on up out this hotel. It'll be just my luck. I come back and try to get a bottle of water and get caught. We're at the hibachi. Bad bitch with the flow. Eating hibachi. Rings blinging, yeah. Pull my shirt. It's a lot easier. Fire, watch your hair, watch your eyebrows. <laughs> oh, watch my eyebrows, they get cut. <laughs> <laughs> Broken heart, get over it. Thank you, sir. Teriyaki chicken. Oh, oh no. Teriyaki. How was the hibachi? Uh, I gave it a five. five. <laughs> it was very mediocre. Man. But she been wanting to try it. I said, wait till I get there. The, uh, the cook was entertaining. Yeah, oh, the cook was real good. But the food itself. Uh-uh. It needs to be updated a little bit. Uh, veggies were... My veggies were sweet. Y'all know I don't like sweet food. My shrimp was a little... Our rice looked like... Looked like... Tastes like it needed to be steamed just a little bit more, right? 
well, I ain't like y'all coming here. <laughs> like, who just gonna come to? We're not even technically in Nashville. Where we at? Yeah. Yes. So. Nicole. Now, I ain't gonna show y'all, but y'all ready. All the way completely naked, huh? <laughs> I hate clothes. Tootsie sale, y'all. It's purple, too. Hey, all up top. Y'all see them? Living their best life, for real. Hunky donkey reels. Hey, y'all downtown look very interesting. All right, guys. We're headed to the museum. As you guys can see, downtown is litty. So this is where we're headed, the National Museum of African American Music. The Katrina boots. Is that Trina Jersey? Or Sequel MC Light. I'm trying to make a beat. <laughs> There's some bass up in there. So it is. Yeah, I'm gonna sign up. If I'm interested, I'm gonna email the. Office. I could be a DJ like some. Uh -huh. <laughs> At the studio, because he said he can go over to the studio. Okay, oh, so I'll do it. It'll be nice to get like a group in there. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. Maybe like a Friday. I wish they could hear it. Where's the mic on the camera? Yeah. I don't know. Okay, cool. Maybe she know me. We in the booth, y'all. Yeah. Let's get up in the booth. See, I should have brought my stand, but I was scared they were gonna make me bring it back to the take it back to the car because it said no selfie stick from the tripod. So let me get on this mic real quick. Mic check one, two, one, two. Yeah. Give me another beat though. Yeah. Yep. Oh. Leading the blind. Man, I'm about to find. Always on your mind. Cause I'm so kind. Always on the grind. Man, I'm confined. <laughs> Look at her, y'all. I'm next. This is very neat. It's way worth the $20, huh? Yeah. It's like dip off after dip off. She found her girl, the one she always put above me. Both of them in the same spot. Dang, who was this small? Whitney? Oh, I want this. Oh, let me calm down. This is tiny. That's like smaller than Tamaya. I got my boo. <laughs> live and in concert. Blended with I think I got the Baptist church bitch or this church of God in Christ. This Baptist, this church of God in Christ back there. Well, I look at this before Apple notes and etc. <laughs> Why do a lot of older people, cause my daddy write like that, write everything in all caps. Um, it used to be a military thing. Oh, well, yeah, that makes sense. Hey, the thrill is gone. Hey, yeah. 
That's what I mean, my grandma, boy. She will embarrass you off the song. That's how I'm trying to be. My grandma can scrub the ground like she had no gristle, cartilages, whatever, bones or none in her knees. And embarrass the hell out of my mama in front of my daddy. We're in the gift shop now. Y'all had to take my nails off and I'm glad I did. Because I got fungus. But that's because I've been soaking every day because my I have been very anxious lately. And that calms me. Fun fact about me, I play the violin if y'all didn't know. I used to chill, sit first chair, first violin from second grade all the way up to my senior year. And I dropped out of orchestra because I wanted to wear nails. Could have got a million scholarships. We could have go sing in a choir. But I don't want to do that with me. Uh, so we get to see a presentation. every hold on y'all because it's real loud right here they um cover every music genre every year it was very interactive huh let me see what was i saying oh yeah and then it was like you can make beats you can record you can sing with the choir what else i do oh uh choreography like I was the lead singer, but woo, I'm tired still. Bojangles with the bones in. Y'all know we just got two Bojangles in Dallas and they bone out. I ain't no, it's all chicken strips and chicken sandwiches. So I look like a real, let me just go and put this up. Baby, I don't work that in that museum, but baby, it's time to nourish for the nourishment of my body. <sighs> back home, back to work, and when I get back home, boy, let me tell you, it's been Chinese New Year and they've been gone, so I done had a little break. Thank you, back tomorrow. Remember video, remember video, and her video, that's how it's gonna be. Y'all yeah, was putting this hand cream up, well, actually, the hand cream is right here. I was like, this shit smell like pickles. It smell like pickles. Mm -hmm. I love this scent, though. It takes me down. Oh, hold on, that's the alcohol in there, though. I gotta put some more of my hand sanitizer in here. I don't sell it no more, but I love the formula and how soft it make my hands feel. When you get real stressed, get that stress relieving. They got the bath soap, the body wash, and just get in the shower. I just inhale it. Probably lady did not. Nah, I mean, I ain't got nah. I hate how she was doing it on the plate. How she do? It was like she wasn't chanting, she was like singing her. Like, she don't know what the hell out of me. I want to go up there and say, give me that mic. <laughs> Rock me, baby. Rock me out. Yeah. Rock me, baby. See, I said I'm gonna do hold on. on. <laughs> Keep me a plate. That, that leg looked like it was fried this morning, but it's okay. She got breakfast. Oh, I see. I kind of lied a little bit. I got a fish now with stir. It's just to try it though. We're gonna try it, but I took the tart off, so you ain't gonna like it. I'm gonna try it on camera. Mm -hmm. That fish too good though. Mm. Real good. It's an actual fish. Mm. They got a voodoo donut in their airport. I'm not a fan of their donuts though. Yeah, that was way harder than I thought. Please maintain control of your personal belongings. Not TSA leaving. Unattended baggage. The code just looks so sad and like <laughs> this is like uh
it's like I just look at her and it's just like a empty soul like she just so and it just turns me down like to look at her but yeah let's get home so guys look what was here when I got back remember at the beginning of the video I was like they made a mistake because they had only sent me this so off this side of here this is so ironic because I just got done hunting that one fragrance down this is sweet on the outside it's the only one that I already have so uh... <laughs> and so this one is Midnight Cafe, which smells just like a YSL Black Opium. Here's Not Another Cherry. I used to have this one, but I gifted it to my cousin and it came right back. It smells like Tom for a Lost Cherry. And this is Flower Bed, which is inspired by, I can't remember. I did a whole reel on these. I can't remember, but um, I think it's Chanel. Yeah, that Chanel Chance, I want to say. I want to say. So, thank you, Final Refragrances. Okay, before I was leaving, I showed you guys this stuff from Elemis. Yeah, of course, Shug. Let me go and put it in Shug stash. <laughs> because I still have, I love Elemis, guys. Shug love it, too. It's bomb.com and sugar. As Charles say, y'all know I be using the night version. And look, here are my pads. Oops. Okay, I be using their oil. I'm going to do a skincare routine on the other page. And I still have a full. So, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Because I was going to say, girl, you ain't getting my brand new one. But she can have it. Y'all, this is what I want to show y'all. Look, I was down to my last. Look, it's at the bottom of the drawer. And I love these resurfacing pads. Oh, my gosh. Both of them are not going to fit in my skincare freeze right now. I might get this one to shoot. And my bomb. I asked her, does she want some? She said, no. I still have quite a bit of that, but I love this scent. I love Elements, guys. Oh, my. I, like, for real, for real. And I, God, I'm too goddamn weak. I just keep it as a backup. I'm sorry, I ain't giving that away. Here, sugar. I let her have the ones. It's only like five, ten left in her. And I got a brand new one. You want some of these? Yep. Show them your nah, cause I don't want them to see your man. Oh, they don't see your man, huh? What? I'll go tell them show show them your blanket, your man, sister brought you. Uh, BRB. <laughs> yeah, she said my man, but I ain't hey, cause wait till I give me one. I'll be like, my man, <laughs> my <laughs> girl, girl, Eddie. <laughs> my phone don't even look the same no more without her. What's that prom night? Yep. There we go. Well, yeah, I'm gonna unpack. I will definitely see y'all in my next vlog. Ooh, yeah, I'm itching. <laughs> so I took that yellow diamond like I was gonna get my cheeks clapped. <laughs> nah, I just needed something compact to throw in my suitcase, baby. If we don't get down like that. I'm saving myself for my husband. <laughs> good night all right guys so i forgot i said i was gonna do this so even though i ate out a lot i still was let me tell you i know what i'm doing so let's see how much i lost all right and this was still eating like fried and everything so yeah just making sure yeah so i came from 20 what was i 205 my target weight is 185, so 11 more pounds and I'm comfortable.